In Istanbul, there is a museum exhibiting developments in the global history of industry, transportation, and communication. The first of its kind in Turkey, the Rami Koç Museum has been open since 1994. The main core of the museum collection consists of items collected since his childhood days of Rami Koç, the founder and a key figure in the development of Turkish industry. Today, the museum exhibits more than 15,000 items gathered over the years from all around the world and ranging from phonograph needles to life-size locomotives, ships and planes. A fun, mysterious, and instructive journey awaits visitors of all ages from the moment they enter the museum doors. The rare and world-renowned collections of the Rami Koch Museum are exhibited in the Lengerhane, Anchor Factory, and Tersane, Dockyard Buildings. Located in Haskö, on the shores of the Golden Horn, both buildings are prime examples of industrial archaeology. The Lengerhane was built over the remains of a 12th century Byzantine structure during the first half of the 18th century under the reign of the Ottoman Sultan Ahmet III. The factory produced naval chains and anchors. After the foundation of the Turkish Republic, the building's ownership was transferred to the Jabali Tobacco Factory. After a fire in 1984, the building was abandoned. In 1991, the Rami Koch Museum and Culture Foundation purchased the Lengerhane building. After two years of restoration, the building was opened for visitors on December 13, 1994, and today contains a number of fine exhibits displayed over three floors. On the ground floor are displayed finely engineered early and historic steam and locomotive models, plus hot air and internal combustion engines, time measuring devices, and a full-size marine steam engine. On the first floor of the Lengerhane building, you can find scientific, photographic, and communication exhibits. The development of aviation, maritime model collections, early and rare steam and clockwork toys, model railways, cinema and printing collections are all exhibited on the basement level. For those who like ships, an authentic wheelhouse is also exhibited with all its equipment. Another historical building belonging to the Rami Koch Museum is the Haskoy Dockyard built in 1861 by the Ottoman maritime company Shirketi Hayriye. The work in the dockyard was not limited to the maintenance of the ferry sailing in the straits in the Marmara Sea. The Sarier and Kojatash were the first passenger ferries produced domestically, and these were constructed in the Haskoy dockyard in 1938. The Rami Koch Museum and Culture Foundation purchased the dockyard in 1996 in order to undertake a complete, authentic restoration of the entire facility. The restoration was completed and opened to the public in July 2001. Other than these two main sections, namely the Lengerhane and the Dockyard, the Rami Koch Museum also displays a number of larger sized items outdoors. Amongst these exhibits are helicopters, planes, trams, locomotives, and the TCG Uluç Ali Reis submarine, which served in the Second World War. The traditional Turkish shops that can be found in the courtyard are one of the favorite areas for museum visitors. Amongst the shops that were copied from historical examples are a scientific instrument maker, pharmacy, cobbler, blacksmith, watchmaker, 
and toy shop. Visitors to the Rami Koch Museum can make short journeys on historical vehicles. One of these short journeys takes place on the narrow gauge train which travels at weekends over a 700-meter track alongside the Golden Horn between Sutlujé and Hasker. During the summer, the restored steam tugboat Liman II takes visitors on a scenic cruise along the historic Golden Horn. The musical carousel offers children a different and yet equally fun journey. Istanbul's first planetarium, Discovery Sphere, which is located in the gardens of the Lengerhane building, offers a remarkable experience by showing animated educational films. Ferry Fenerbahce, which has carried passengers on the Bosphorus and to the Prince's Islands for half a century, is now a guest of the Rami Koch Museum. The Fenerbahce, fully restored and turned into a museum exhibit, proudly invites visitors to enjoy the remarkable scenery from its decks while taking refreshments. Visitors who wish to take a break from the exhibits of the museum can enjoy the nostalgic Coca-Cola kiosk or Demlik Cafe, where they can enjoy the views of the exhibits outdoors. We should also mention the Rami Koch Museum's famous restaurants and cafes, which provide exceptional atmosphere and serve delicious meals. Café du Levant, which has regular patrons from all around the city, is located in the courtyard of the Lengerhane building. This brasserie recreates the mood of 1930s Paris and serves delicious examples of French cuisine. Halat restaurant serves outstanding examples of Mediterranean cuisine. The wonderful scenery the restaurant offers turns meals into feasts. On summer evenings, visitors enjoy views of the Golden Horn from the waterside terrace. The Barbarossa pub, designed and furnished as an exact replica of a British pub, is decorated with antique items and is like a museum within a museum. The Rami Koch Museum contributes to the social, emotional, mental, and physical development of children and their manual skills by organizing a variety of workshops. These workshops help children increase their imaginative and creative powers. At the core of the different educational packages available, the Rami Koch Museum offers students a primary educational package established with themes covered by the National Education Curriculum and the museum's exhibits. The educational packages, which emphasize visual skills, promote research-directed teaching and learning, help students to appreciate the museum and teach them how to make best use of it. These packages are attractive to schools that are willing to experiment with and have their students experience alternative teaching environments. The Rami Koch Museum hosts nationally and internationally famous exhibitions. Since its foundation, the museum has attracted approximately half a million visitors with the Leonardo Universal Genius Exhibition, Brain Exhibition, 
Henry Kupchak's Miniature Rooms exhibition, and Invisible Musicians exhibition. The Rami Koch Museum also hosts a variety of corporate events, such as business dinners, meetings, press launches, and cocktail parties. The Erdogan Gönül Gallery and Conference Hall provides services that satisfy all sorts of organizational demands. We have, of course, not forgotten the children. The Rami Koch Museum, a favorite of children thanks to the fun and educational activities it hosts, also organizes birthday parties, which offer unforgettable experiences for children. Fun activities and age-specific workshops help children have an unforgettable birthday. The Rami Koch Museum, known and respected around the globe, today attracts more than 300,000 visitors every year. Due to its interactive and lively character, the museum offers many surprises for its visitors. The interest in the museum increases each and every day, thanks to the coexistence of a wide range of items, ranging from submarines, trains, boats, and planes to rare toys, and thanks to the pedestrian-friendly nature of the layout of the museum. More than 15,000 items await visitors who want to learn, experience, see, taste, and live history, and, in short, have a wonderful time.